Hey, 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 Stubby here. And I'm about to sell you some goods. Seriously. Come by my oak saplings. Somebody. Please. Check out Restrict Skyblock. Let's go. Hey everybody, Stubby here, and today we are checking out a wonderful new pack. This is uh, Restrict Skyblock. So this hack pack has a pretty unique spin. I like it. Uh, you got portals over here. Each one of these islands, you have to submit something, do something. Uh, and that's how you get to the another dimension. Um, we're gonna read about that, but it, it's a unique twist on Skyblocks, I think. So. Collect our chest stuff. A dirt, apple, quest book, bread, and the OB maker. Nice. Alright, so, get started. We're going to run through the quests. Welcome to Restrict Skyblock. This mod pack completely changes the way you get started in this world and progress to the different dimensions. Aiming for a new but not grindy progression. The quest book is accessible at all times. The goal, the point of it all. Make me a present. A particular present. If you look around, you can see some islands off in the distance. Three of those have gateways to other dimensions that you will unlock by making certain items and fluids for me. Traveling to each dimension will grant you access to more and more varied resources, allowing you to start making what you need to make my present. I'm telling you about JEI. Alright, so instead of the usual tree punching to get started, I've given you a magically self renaming block to punch instead the OB Maker. Inside your chest and Find it, put it in the world. This can't be moved once placed. Okay, right. so the OB maker. This makes a block. You, you know, uh, put it, put it down. This block, I'll break it, and now all of a sudden a sand will appear or so on. In fact, you get clay, coarse dirt, cobweb, dirt, flint, grass, gravel, oak slab, pebble, red sand, sand, snow, leaves, stick, straw bales, and water. Um, but it isn't one block that you put down. It actually, it's a three by three. Uh, so we're going to come up with a nice spot for it because it is permanent. And I kind of like the idea of these pathways to the islands. So I want to leave, if I can, a three by three away from them. It's hard to tell the center. Ah, I might not even be centered. Okay. I mean, we could just do it right here, I think, actually. Yeah. Okay, so we're going to just basically right-click on this block. Ta-da! And now we have our one block. So, like I said, here's the... Uh, now another block just appears and appears and appears and appears. Then we get water. Alright, so we put that block down. The unfired clay bucket is a quest that's coming up. And I don't think I have enough for it yet. Nope. So, what do you do when you get water? Well, you either use a bucket to take the water out, or you throw something in its place. Come on. Need the flint now. All right, come on, one more, one more, one more.
Got it. All right. So. Get four chests out of that. Nice. All right. And. I wanted us to make. The unfired clay bucket. And some water. Darn. Alright, so, see what I'm doing. Uh, the unfired clay bucket. I said, uh, we don't have any uh, crafting benches, so we can throw stuff in water. They do have fluid transmutation. So, for this, we're going to throw three clay blocks into the water and get our clay bucket. That's what we're shooting for right now. We get water again. Sheesh. When I wanted Flint, we got like 20 waters. <laughs> there we go. All right, so we're going to throw one, two, three. And we got our bucket. And we get a stone wand. All right, so next thing we need to do is make a campfire, which was two slabs and two flint. And we might as well knock out the cutting board, which is slabs and sticks, and flint and sticks. So as long as we have enough sticks, okay, we do. Flint and stick. There's that, and then it was slab and stick. Cutting board, and that was campfire. All right, so we are going to put our campfire down in a nice and toasty spot. Mm. Oh, just put it right there. Raw cod, raw fish. Eating a wide variety of foods will increase your health pool. And when you start to get hungry, you might want to try the cutting board and a flint knife. Using that will make your food supplies last longer, and the bone meal will be needed later. Get a coin for the clay bucket. And what it's saying to do is we are using the campfire in lieu of a furnace. So it should hopefully be smelting that into... Whoa. That was close. Uh, and we'll go ahead and dig here, here, and here. This will be a good spot for our water. What? Uh, Um, there, there we go. That was weird. Huh. Alright. Alright, Minecraft mobs will spawn at night. We do the bed. We need wool, which will be made from string, which can be made from cobwebs. So, three cobwebs. Doesn't look like we have enough yet. Uh, and the vendor. Oh, I'm looking at this, we are going to need those. Okay. So, are you ready for real crafting bench yet? I know you can't make a make red dye yet for the wool, but if you look around, there should be a lovely red tulip you can use. Warning: bone meal and grass won't generate flowers on a new island until after a server restart. So we're going to need four sticks, which we should have rope, which is straw and the knife. Three straws make a rope, and we get nine. So let's check this one out. Should be something in this nature. No, water, 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 water. Alright, and planks. Right, I'm 
very confused. How do we get Oh, 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 I was like, dude, how do I get, how, I was like, how do I get this wood when I have a very obvious sapling already? And twerking is not a thing. Shake my booty at the tree. Nothing. Nope. Okay. All right, so we're going to work towards that. It's like we're going to need to get the oak trees. We need to get there. And then we'll get to a crafting bench. Lots of clay, wood, and we get to the iron. All right. All right, guys. So what I'll do is I'm gonna pause here. I'm going to dig this block out for a few, collect some resources, and I'll be back when we've got a little bit more to work with here. Go ahead and break this chest. That's better. Alright, be back. Alright guys, so hopefully that was enough resources. Uh, collected myself a pretty decent amount. Alright, and I wanted to get ourselves some bone meal. Oh, we gotta throw down our cutting board. back and forth. And we'll go ahead. One, two, three, four. Let those cook. Be over here waiting for him to shoot off. Soon? Possibly? Thirty seconds. Okay. Alright, so do we need to do what is this? One, two. That and that. I did get a, another bucket of water, so I now have a truly infinite source. All right. String. On it. Oh, she hears. Oh, all right. Whoa. Uh, hi. Hello, guys. Well, how do I keep you? I want to keep you. I like you. Sorry for scaring you. And... Shears. We got a sheep. In all honesty, we're just going to do this. Thank you. Haha. -ha. Oh, that's actually enough for the bed, so let's go ahead and shear up some webs, too. And. That should be good for that one. Hey! 
Look at that. And we need the bone meal that I got, because I'm going to need the spruce. And Veinmire is a thing. Nice, 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 nice. Not going to plant you again, because I think we're actually ready for the next step. So we need four sticks. One, two, three, four. We need one red wool. We need one rope and five spruce planks. And one rope. I looked ahead on the next step, so I need to start getting these cooking. So, one rope, five of those. Oh, wait, why did I grab that wool? That's not right. Is that one? We got a market. Can I get another coin? And so for the market, we're going to go ahead, excuse me, sir. Whistle. All right, we need a oak tree. Five bone meal. Three, four, five. And now we have our sapling. We'll go ahead and grab a couple more bone meal. There we go, guys. We got, oh, 64 logs. And the next thing we're gonna make is the crafting station. Which is a crafting bench recrafted. I think this actually sees the attached inventory. It does, perfect. Oh. Boom boom. Thank you for the coin. Feeding trough. Feeding trough is filled with carrots, wheat, and seeds. We'll feed the animals around, helping your livestock multiply with minimal input from you. The chicken nest collects eggs around it, and a hopper or a pipe can funnel the collected eggs into storage. What I'm going to do is keep you guys alive somehow. I don't really have enough fence yet. I could, uh, let's do this. Should we go to it? Yeah, okay. Oh, I don't want to take over that. For now, and we're going to go ahead and make ourselves Hopefully I'm doing this right. One, two, three, four, five. Didn't want to use that, so we're going to do it like this. I need one, two, three, Four, five, six, seven, seven more. And we will need one that is a gate. Now 
we just have to find a way to convince our friends to come with us. How to make a hoe. Traditional way. Don't have carrots, so come on, guys. Come on. Come on. In. 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 Yeah, there's one. In. 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 Hey, right, Mr. Piggy, you just need to come up here. Okay, right, so while we're waiting on him, we're going to work on the automation. This is what I was doing with the uh, prepping this stuff. So we need to make, with the help of some simple hoppers and high-tech machines, your days of block punching can be over. Craft the generator, place the hopper underneath, and put the catalyst we just received inside the generators to reveal, revel in the simplicity of our first resource automation. So we're going to need to make two automators and two wooden hoppers. Or generator. Two generators? Is that what they're called? Ex Nahalo generator. So we need to make, go ahead and make four wooden hoppers. Looks like I have two chests. We're gonna want two for the end bag. There we go. Wooden hoppers. One. Four of those, and then. of those and I wasn't thinking that it needed chess so we make some more no no over here piggy no no sir no that is a very dangerous spot sir bang I scared you go the other way pig oh I don't like that there's really not a nice way out for me there Ha. ha 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 we did it we saved the animals we are heroes all right and so this resource generation put the dirt back let's go ahead and expand ourselves a little bit we're gonna put it right here all right and would not Wooden hopper, wooden hopper. Generator, generator. Ta-da! And now we collect these block catalysts. Ground one. And this should start automatically producing. Look at that. It's just going right away. Production at its finest. Yeah, we're already collecting iron. We're getting hungry, so we're going to start with the raw ones. We're going to work our way up this food chain. Nice, look at this go. All right. Um, pebbles. Okay. This all works from in here, actually. We got a furnace. So with this furnace, let's go ahead and craft ourselves. Need one of those. That is doing beautifully. Oh, we're getting prismarine shards now. What else are we getting? New pumpkin seeds, lily pads, snowballs. Nice. 
Okay. Ceramic milk bucket. If you punch through one block long enough, you may have gotten it to spawn some animals for you. Spawn eggs are available at the market to fill to fill out your breeding pairs. Note: killing animals with a flint knife vastly improves the rates for secondary drops. So we need to buy some spawn eggs. It seems like to give the pairs. You know what? Actually, let's go ahead and do one, two, three. Let's be smart. And a bed. Ah, I see how you're going to be. All right, so we need. Uh-huh. So the white bed, we also need the stone axe, which is made with two sticks, a rope, and three cobble. Two sticks, a rope, and three cobble. All right, so let's do this. Two sticks, rope, three cobble. Axe, wood. Next one, three chests in, so I think I might have messed it up. Wool. There, there. No? Was I wrong? Oh, it's spruce planks. Ah. And we got ourselves a bed. Let the nap time commence. Waypoint, which we are not going to put up yet. We don't have any fast travel needs at the moment. That is awesome. All right, so the next step, we need to make our generators run for a little while. We're going to have a not going to be getting redstone right away it looks like but we will be getting gold iron and stone so gold and iron said we needed eight of each so we're close to having enough iron but we are we have enough iron now we just need to worry about the gold and cobblestone Ooh, diamond. We're going to have a diamond soon, it looks like, guys. Alright, so the hoppers. Uh, it's going to be a lot, a lot, a lot of clay. How much do we actually have? I think each one takes like five. Yeah. Each, each. It's essentially takes eight blocks to make one hopping buns. Like, because you got to use five blocks right here. And another three clay balls right here, so one clay shy of a whole block. Trough. If we're smart, we'll put a bucket of water out and get some crops going. Some hemp, some wheat. Melon, maybe, why not? And all the seeds on this side. We have some pumpkin. That's it. So let's go ahead and make a hoe. And a bucket of water. And some dirt. Right, so we're going to do it like this. Boom, 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 boom. Four, one, two, three, four.
One, two, three, four, water source. There we go. And a little extra, but it's alright. Boom. Melons we're gonna put on the end. Pumpkins we're gonna put on the end. Might as well grab the rest of our seeds. One, two, three. Melon, melon. Oh, I lost. Aww. Oh. Now we just put more another row of wheat. And hopefully I get another pumpkin seed soon. Because that was kind of sad. I lost my pumpkin seed. Alright, guys. So we're at a stopping point here. Uh, it's been about 30 minutes. Uh, in between episodes, I'm going to push towards the gold that we need. What do I need for these breeding pairs? All oh, one coin. And we have three. Thankfully, you don't actually need to breed the Uh, chickens. Any luck? Nope. Hmm. Another gold. So no more pumpkin seeds. I might live my life without pumpkins. No. Oh well. Alright guys. That's it. So we're going to stop right here. We're going to work in between episodes towards collecting the clay for the hopper botany pots and we're going to work towards collecting all the items for here this one that's just going to be smelting the dust up right here into the ingots and that'll give us some redstone and some time in a bottle the item pipes are going to be some redstone cobblestone and the iron and the wrench is just a couple of flint and then the drawer controller. So we should have everything ready at the uh, beginning of the next episode. We'll have the resources built up that we can just start running down right here about the floral fertilizer. We'll spend the first 30 seconds crafting up these items right here, and we'll go. And I'll probably use the dirt that's coming to expand our area a little bit, get some more room, grow some trees so we're not quite so compact. And until then, see you next time. Stubby out.